welcome to another quick look at the Brave series, um, Brave of Gold, Goldrand. This is Leon Kaiser. Here's his box real quick. Another big box. We see Kaiser, we see Leon here, and then Leon Kaiser, obviously. Picks on the side, various characters, and their combination form. See some of the gimmicks that he comes with, the missile launching, individual picks, some anime picks, and some Korean writing that I can't read. So, there's the box. Now let's take a look at the pig. Alright, here are the two components that form Leon Kaiser. We got Leon and Kaiser. So let's take a look at Leon real quick. He's a nice giant gold lion. Um, he's got some articulation, which is nice, in both leg joints. His mouth can open, but you can only open it so far because this actually becomes the robot's head, so you don't want to... I don't know, it looks kind of weird, but that looks kind of nice. Blue there. Missile cannons. Tail. Or what should be a tail, I guess. And that's it. Just like Gold Gun, um, he doesn't really transform into a robot on its own. So, let's take a look at Kaiser here. Kaiser is a nice fighter jet. Nice gold. Unlike Dran, though, we don't get full gold, gold everywhere, so that's kind of um, sad. Um, other than that, though, he still looks nice. I like how the jewel is actually like the cockpit there. Underneath part, I mean, you see a lot of robot kibble, unfortunately. It does have a landing gear. That's nice. To transform him, really easy. Pull his legs down. Pull those back. Push this back, turn his head around, and there you go. There's Kaiser. Nice stickers. I mean, at least these stickers kind of cover the screw holes, which is nice. He's got a lot more articulation. It's just because of some of the transformation that he has to go with. Um, great gold run. So he's got, I guess, leg movement. He can go to the out, um, pivot to the outside, shoulder joint, elbow joint, swivel at the elbow, and that's about it. And his head swivels. Unlike Dran, though, he doesn't have the gold chrome everywhere here. It would have been nice if at least this part may have been gold, but... Oh well. It does come with a weapon, or a spear of some sort, which is kind of nice. So that's cool. Now let's transform him into Leon Kaiser. Let's take him first. What we're going to do with him is we're going to actually move his tail fins the opposite direction now. And then um, we're just going to fold his legs in like so. And he's done. <laughs> Set him off to the side. All right. Take Leon here. Take the missile cans out. Set those to the side. Take his tail out. This will later become a gun, I guess. Oh, these little floppy things always come undone. There's no real purpose for these until Great Gold Run. Little button back here. Push it. Helps extend the legs. Push these back. It's going to become heel spurs. Hold his feet up, or his bottom portion of his legs. Rotate him around. Take these missile launchers. Little tabs there, they're going to fit right in there. Rotate 
his paw down, look out his hands. Nope. There we go. Put this portion up, rotate it down. Just gonna do this side and those gold pieces. Come back to bite me here. There we go. Almost done. Take Kaiser. Slot him in the chest, just like Dran. Pop up the head. Put down the face and there we go. There is Leon Kaiser. Really nice. I mean, that is a really cool head. I mean, the lines, head and mane, become part of the head. That's pretty cool. The blue, I like that. The contrast with the gold. Really nice. Um, again, it would have been nice if it had a little more gold, but that's not too big of a deal. Um, the only other gripe I would have with this fig is... Um, this part right here become his feet, which is, you know, works, but it would have been nice if there was some sticker or something because over time, if you're not careful, this will wear because this is like flush with his other feet. And so when he's standing and you move him around, you're going to just scrape this gold, which is unfortunate. Other than that, I mean, that's a nice big piece of gold. I mean, reflective, nice chrome gold. So that's unfortunate. And it would have been nice if they would have maybe tucked the head made some way that the head wasn't just right right there. His accessories comes with this large spear. And again, this becomes his gun. And for some reason, I cannot get this to stay in his hand. I don't know why. It's kind of a pain. Oh well. I usually have them displayed as great gold or anyway, so this part will be used for another weapon. So, all in all, I mean, he does have the missile features. He's got a missile launcher on each side of his wrist there, and then he's got these. Gold piece again falls off. And then obviously, his gun can fire a missile. All right, this has been a short review. Um, Great Gold Run's coming up next. This guy basically just becomes just parts for if you saw my Sorokagi fig review, um, I showed you at the end Sky Gold Run. So this guy is going to break down and be put to use on that guy and become Great Gold Run. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching and take care. Bye.